You've seen unboxings, but have you seen reboxings? Today's reboxing is one of the most inconceivable ones yet. I'm going to show you everything in the Princess Bride storybook game, and as an added bonus, we're going to seal it up as if it's brand new on Legendary Tactics. And now for something a little bit different. We are gonna start with all the components out of the box. Take a quick look at the rule book here. It's really nice and simple. We'll get into that later. The artwork for the game looks a little bit like it's from the Uncanny Valley, but if you like that, check that out. This is the reference card, flip it over. On the other side, you've got a basic sampling of what you do each turn. Everybody gets one of those. Let's reseal that into the baggies. We don't want any air getting in there. This is going to be perfect when they're done. The replay card is not what you want in the game. That's a bad sign. These are all the tokens, challenge tokens, lightning tokens, ROUS tokens, flame spurts, wound tokens. We'll get that card back up in the box. Let's check out some of the other cards in the games. We have already seen the reference cards. There are also special cards, story cards, and plot cards. The plot cards are the green ones. You can see that all of these are thematically linked to the game. We'll just suck those back up into the hand so we can get a nice close look at them. And every character from the book that you love is in here. Here are some of the other game mechanic cards that help uh, push the game forward. This is a little bit reminiscent of the artwork from the Battle of Wits game, and uh, which, which I would not recommend um, you playing. However, um, the Princess Bride storybook game is a lot of fun. So that's a good look at the cards. We need to put the plastic back on those. Just pop it in like that. Zip. And you're gonna seal that up with your fingers. Just pull it on tight and that will do the trick. Now you need to get some sort of knife or something to really uh, seal that up. So let me get the uh, most practical and versatile knife I know, my Swiss Army knife, and I'll use the screwdriver tool for that. This is the man in black. Nice pieces, this is my favorite part of the game. We've got Inigo Mantoyas and Count Rugen there. We've got Bassini and Fezzik. All really nice, feel really good. We got Prince Humperdinck, Princess Buttercup. Get those back into the plastic as well. We're starting to get this nicely organized. Very good, seal it tight. All right, let's take a look at the storybook now. So this is probably the best part of the game. This is the actual board of the game. So first we've got the As You Wish Chapter 1 Challenge. Next we've got the Chapter 2 Escape by Sea. Third we've got the Cliffs of Insanity. And fourth we've got the Fire Swamp. Fifth up we've got the It'll Take a Miracle. And finally sixth we've got Have Fun Storming the Castle. So in order to beat the game, to get to the end, you need to beat all of those missions. You don't have to do it all in one sitting. You can do one at a time. Let's grab that rule book. We'll take a quick look. These are the components of the game. As you've seen, there aren't too many of them. There's some nice artwork in here. It's all thematic with the movie. And uh, the setup instructions for each of these scenarios is really nice and clear. So you can get into the game really quickly. We'll get that back into the box. We need to just seal those little stickers there. This one did not come with shrink wrap. So um, that is inconceivable to me. So might as well use the corkscrew um, because that would make logical sense to, uh, to zip it up with the corkscrew there. That is the Princess Bride game. If you got value or enjoyment out of this video, please consider subscribing and give us a like. Thanks so much for your time.